guys i'm really surprised what is going on here you know i have just came from my home place right now and i have just found the, the electricity pole has just been as you know very well the electricity is very it is very dangerous by the way and you can see that post is on going to our house there so it is very dangerous and what i think there is no electricity here so what if the electricity was there guys this could be it couldn't have been dangerous to to us here in the village the entire village by the way but maybe it's because of god plans the electricity wasn't there guys maybe right now we could have been saying another story you know electricity is very dangerous in fact and by the way it has just taken like three months yeah like three months without electricity here and this the wall of this bridge are very are struggling for the light in fact yeah there is no light here but we are hoping that the the kenya powers will come soon and do something here because this 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 place by the way it is very dangerous what if the the electricity come today yeah it will be so dangerous to to us here, to our family here, also to entire village. Yeah, so guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel, Mama Aunt's Family. Yeah, we are, it is, for, by the way, today it's a sad moment. Yeah, today, guys, it's a sad moment to the family. And we are hoping that God is going to attack us, God is going to be with us during this sad moment. Yeah, and, yeah, and God is going to... Yeah, God is going to be with us through your player by the way. So, continue watching our video till the end so that you can just know what sad moment is it. So, yeah, continue watching the video till the end. I will let you know. Yeah, I will let you know. Yeah, so continue watching the video till the end. You will let, I will let you know what the sad moment is. By the way, you know, yesterday I, I didn't come here because... I was sick also you remember yesterday i didn't post a video because i was not feeling well yeah so let me bring somebody to tell us what is going on here because yesterday i wasn't there and i have just came here right now yeah and i have just found this post lying down so you can just come and tell us what is going on because i wasn't here yesterday so uh, something that uh... We made this pole, you see it fall down. Yeah. This pole was not uh, permanent, permanently made, yeah. and that is why you see it is down. Yesterday I was here, then uh, uh, the Kenya power around. We thought that they are going to return back the electricity, yeah. but we found them cutting the cables, yeah. and uh, some of them, they went to them. You see, to the down there, there's another one that they cut. There's another cable that they cut there. So they left them they like this. But we thank God because there was no electricity. If the electricity could be there, mm. even the trees could suffer here. Eh? Yeah. They could get fire and they could burn. And you see that this cable that bring the, the electric like to, our to house. your house, to your mama aunt's house, it is the which has supported this this post. But if this cable could be cut, this post could be down. But now we thank God because it, it, it is still there. So we don't know whether they are going to come and to repair back or to give us back the electricity because we have suffered for long. Even as we, we are tired of buying candles, no kerosene, using them. Yeah. yeah, even I, I see how my mom is just struggling at night, you know. At night, they really struggle on lightning. Even my brothers really struggle on how they will study that during night, you know. But I'm hoping one day I'm going to buy for my mama solar. Yeah, yeah. That big solar so that my brother cannot struggle. You know, this has just taken three months without light here. But, three months? But yeah, it is three so long. months. It's it so, so long. long. Yeah. So this, the whole of this village is really struggling, but we are hoping everything will be well. So guys, you can just, I can see my mom is just doing something there. Yeah, we can just go and see how my mom is working. What is she doing there? So let's go and hear from her on what, what happened here, you know. 
and she will let us know. Yeah, so guys, this is my brother, by the way. Yeah, he's our neighbor here, and then our village here. Yeah, yes. you can just. Yes, guys, I'm also a YouTuber by the name Motatiro001. We live within the village here, guys. Yeah. So you can also, guys, go and check him on his, on his YouTube channel. His name is Motatiro001. If you haven't subscribed to his channel, go and check on him and subscribe to his channel. Yeah, support to yeah, I hey, will man. be happy, guys, if you, you subscribe to my channel. At least, okay, guys, I will be happy of that. Thank yeah. you so much. They will do so. So, guys, we have just arrived at my mom. You can just see my mom is just working. Yeah, what are you? I can see she's doing something here. Yeah, she's doing something here. Mom, what are you doing? She's cutting the kels, guys. She's cutting the kels. She wants to cook for us. In fact, we are hungry. I myself am hungry. Yeah, so say hi to people before we proceed now. Na wasalemia katika china ra Yesu. Kwa mzima, shukuru mwenyezi mungu. Kwa mari hapa siku ya leo, da katakata mboga, pikia watoto. Maisha ya ndere vizuri. Yeah, she's saying that she thank God today she's she's good. She's cutting the kelps to cook for the for us. Yeah, for we we are his we are his children. Yeah, so she thank God for that. Yeah, yeah. Thank you so much. So now, what happened? Now na he he polyestima ime ime angu kanini kinaendelea. You see who happened. Missy June, Liona to what one of you want to cut up? Eh, what he cut a jan. Ninini is a bishop and look. A punastima. Ninini is a bishop whom you didn't buy as your Missouri son, a yos your yeo cabisa. Eh, see, you refine a jay. Sure, Missouri, it is an idiot pick your chin. It is a ticker chin. So, my mom is trying to say that that Paul has just a lot and. Mm. Yeah, it has just rotten, so that's why it it slide down. Yeah, so and also she's just trying to say that yesterday the Kenya Power came and they cut the those wires and they go with them. So we don't know whether they will come to to put the the electricity or not. Siju kama hata yeye na esa esta sababu sa imharipi yumba si juisa. She's trying to say that we need to mess with, with this wire mess with the house. But it won't. Eh? It won't mess. Okay. Thank okay, you ma. so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. 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 She really thanks because she see that those vegetables, we are working there, we are working hard. Yeah, she's eagerly waiting for those veggies to grow and she will start harvesting. Namshukuru mwenyezi mungu. Ju Sunday triambiwa tunaenda mkutano Mombasa. Namshukuru mwenyezi mungu. Sijawai yaenda Mombasa. Taka ni safiri. Tuna safiri siku ya ijuma. Yeah, she, she's saying that she thanks God because since she was born she ha, has never been in at Mombasa but on Sunday yesterday yeah they were told that on on Wednesday I'm on Thursday on Friday mm. on Friday they are supposed to go to Mombasa for the fellowship so she's very happy because now she will be flying she will be flying bila naenda Mombasa na siaweenda Nina Imani Tenda America. She's happy. She's saying that she's happy because this is the this is her first time going to she will go to Mombasa and she's hoping that also if she will go to Mombasa, also one day she will fly and reach at USA. Yeah. She will one day she will also fly to to America. And the reason as to why she's going to Mombasa, she's going for fellowship. For the church fellowship, yeah. So they have just planned that they will go on Friday, yeah. For 
yeah, for the church fellowship na mshukuru mwenyezi Mungu asidi kunisaidia asidi yani namtegemea Mungu asidi kunifungulia milango ya hera nipate niende uko wali niambia nitafute 12300 zo zingine watanilipia zina unaenda na 1500 Yeah she's saying that she thank God because yeah she thank God and God will open his doors and she will find those the transport yeah she was told that to find at least 2000 and the, the rest they will pay for her yeah the rest they will pay for her so they were supposed to pay 5000 each but she has said that they Mwenyezi Mungu sijawahi kwenda Mombasa ni mara yangu ya kwanza kwenda Mombasa nilikuwa nafika tu hapa karibu tu namshukuru sana kwa sababu Mungu alinichagua kuwa kiongozi wa maombi hasa ndio tunataka kwenda Mombasa naomba Mungu wa mbinguni mwenye ako na nauli ni shilingi 5000 lakini pasa walisema watanilipia 3000 nitafute 2000 nitafute 2300 Lakini yeah. Mungu ni wajabu sitapatikana tu. Yeah, she is saying that yeah, she thank God because God chose her to be uh, a, an intercessor by the she is an intercessor at her church and they were told to go to Mombasa for the fellowship and the church will pay for them 3000 Kenya shillings and them they were they are supposed to go to cater for 2000 Kenya shillings so the total amount will be, it is about 5000 so she's saying that she's praying to god god will attach somebody and she will get that money and she will go to the fellowship at Mombasa yeah yeah that is correct you know being a member of a church there are some parts that if you are a leader you have to travel from one church to another place yeah, yeah. So you know the the story is saying is true so guys if if you god can touch you kindly support you in the, the anything that you show, you can have so that you can even travel so you know even traveling is uh, important to some people you cannot stay in a village you are born there you marry there you taught there then you come all without even going outside your country yeah. so even the uh, mama here mama aunt here you guys kindly support him so that support us so that even he can travel to Mombasa you know even travel he can see good things outside there yeah. then he can come and eh, talk, uh, tell other people and even other people can be happy of having dream of traveling from one place <laughs> to another yeah, yeah. We pr- so apart from going to Mombasa yeah. the main reason of going there is praying yeah, yeah. so you know he's praying for us in the village here so that you can have peace eh? Yeah. So the main thing of Mama Ans is just for going to for prayers there at Mombasa guys. So we we hope that you are going there and you pray for us so that even us one day we can uh, have uh, that faith to go and pray there so that we can receive that fruits eh, yeah. of prayer from God. Yeah. I hope that. Yeah, so mom don't worry God is going to open his doors and by the way you will go in yeah. Jesus name. Thank you. You will go. When are you you have just say you will, you are supposed to go on Friday. On Friday. Yeah. Naenda Friday ya subuhi. Okay. You will go in Jesus name. Amen. Yeah, so thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Taenda ni waombe. Maana ni maombi tutaenda ya ngufu. Bila kunywa kafu asubuhi mpaka jioni. As, jioni ndio tunakula kama saa mbili ndio tunakula sasa chai yeah she is saying that she will go and pray for us because there they will go to they will fast yeah they will go there and start fasting yeah they will be eating at night only but the daytime since morning to night they will be fasting and the key point there is they are going to pray for us for us for the country for the whole world and also mostly for we as youtubers so thank you so much mom when you go there remember in prayers in this hard time that you are going and god will be with us thank you taenda ni waombe kabisa mungu awafungulie milango afungulia marafiki zangu milango kabisa 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 kwa sababu mungu kimwambia kitu yeye anatenda tu ana yani ana 
anaongojea tu mwambie kitu. Ukimwambia tu kitu Mungu na anasikia haraka sana. Yeah. So <laughs> wishing you the masses. <laughs> yeah. you travel. I know now you are counting days, eh? Yeah? Yeah. It's like three days to so wish you the masses. God there remembers and remember our village and the other parts of the the world. The world. Yeah. No. Eh, mom, today you are, you are by the day you are smart. Leo uko smart. Mbona umeamua kuvaa kofia leo? Eh, si nimeamua kuvaa ni kwa sababu. Ni kwa sababu. Niko na furaha sana. Ndio maana nimefaa hiyo nguo. Sababu unaenda Kwa sababu naenda Mombasa. Okay. Niko na furaha sana ukweli sijawahi enda. Yaani niko na furaha. Ina imani nikienda Mombasa. America naenda, America naenda kusalamia marafiki zangu ni waone macho kwa macho. Kwa sababu unajua Mungu saa hii sasa ameanza kuniamulia kufanya mambo nitembe. Siku anatembea. Kitoka Mombasa naenda kuambia Mungu niende Nairobi tena, niende mo America tena maombi, niende kuombea watu wa America. She's just trying nataka. to say that she's happy because this week she's going to Mombasa on Friday she will be going to Mombasa. And she are hoping that after Mombasa, she will go to America to pray yeah. for people in America there. Yeah, so that is her dream and her prayer. And yes. so, ma'am, uh, we are in a sad moment, in fact. Our family is a sad moment. Family yetu saizi na umboreza. Uneza tuambiazi? Unajua? Tibiri na sema? Sisi ni wasafi. Lakini baba taendrea kuambia saidi. Saidi. Kweli tuko na matanga lakini bibiri nasema sisi ni wasafiri. Atujui saa wala siku kwa sababu hata huyu baba hapo anajua saa. Alistukia tu Mungu amemchukua. Kwa sababu tunaambia tutegemee Mungu. Kila wakati tuko mikononi mwa Mungu. Maana sisi hatujui saa wala siku. Yeah she's saying that our dad will tell us the sad moment. Our dad is inside and he will tell us on how what is that our what is that sad moment and she's also saying that you know here in here we as human being we, we are traveler yeah we are the traveler we can never know our days it's only god who knows so mom yeah Thank you so much. I can Thank see you. you can just go inside and cook for us. And the cook karanga mboga. Yeah, you go and cook for us because you are hungry. I myself am so hungry. Okay, mom, you just go and cook for us. But when I will finish the video, yeah. I will come and assist you. Yes. Yeah. After finishing, you mm. just go. After finishing, I will come there to help you. Okay? Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. And also, Thank guys, you. remember. We are going on with our project. Yeah, don't forget about our project. We are going on with the kitchen garden there. Yeah, kitchen garden there, and also our kit, our our mama aunt's kitchen. Yeah, it is ongoing, though it's going slow by slow. But we are hoping that God is going to open His doors, and we will finish. You know, God's time is the best. God time, as I told you. As I told you always, God's time is the best. Yeah, so I'm hoping that very soon we are going to finish making these blocks and we will start, we will start, we will be starting the foundations. Yeah, very soon. Yes. So guys, you can just see this is the blocks that we have just made till now. Yeah, this is three, I think it's 378, 372 or 376? Two. No, it's three. 372. 372 blocks. So we have just remained with 648 blocks for us to reach the target. And as I told you, we have just remained inside with seven bags of cement. With seven bags of cement. And by the way, we are hoping that by the end of this week, by next week, we will be finishing. Yeah. So, guys, we have just remained with about 19, 19 bags of cement for us to finish making blocks. But we are hoping by this, the end of this week, we will be finishing making blocks and we will start the foundation by the 
as I told you, this can we go and show them the where the foundation will be? Okay. Yeah, so guys, in fact, after finishing this week by day, I told you we are going to finish making these blocks and we will start the foundation there immediately. And also we have just yeah, and also when we will get one rory, one tip of one rory of sand, it will be enough for making blocks. Yeah, so we need one rory and the remain I think the re, the remaining sand will will start the foundation. It will help us to start the foundation immediately as I told you this. Immediately we finish making these blocks by this week. Yeah, we are going to start the foundation there. And we are hoping also to get one rory of sand. And the remaining sand we are going to use it for the foundation. Yeah, so guys, you can see we are then these blocks here for it to to dry. For it to dry, you can see it has just to dry. Yeah, it has just to dry. Yeah, it's good here by the way. Yeah, so yeah, so guys, apart from these old things that I have just told you, remember also labors, yeah, the cost of labors are needed, and also the transport, yeah, and also the transport. Also, those who will be working here, they need to eat, you know, you can't work without eating. Yeah, we will need to cook for them and so that they can work. Yeah, so that they can work very good. Yeah, so Matatiro. Yeah. How do you see these blocks? Are they dry or how can you see them? Yeah, the way I'm seeing them, mm -hmm. and because of this heavy rains, yeah. these things are uh, they are dry well. Yeah. They cannot be destroyed even with rain. You see, the, since the rain started raining, mm -hmm. they have not even cracked anywhere. You can see like this one. This one was uh, when the, we were arranging the, this way. So that is why it cracks here, but it is dry. Yeah. Yeah, you know the reason as to why we arrange them here? It is for because the rain usually rain. The rain is so heavy here in, in African Kenya. So we decided to arrange them here so that it can dry easily. And right now you can see it is dry, okay? Yeah. So me, I have a question to ask you. Yeah. The way you, you see you have started this project, you made blocks, there are some things that you should uh, you should uh, make sure that they, they have been provided so that to make this project easy yeah. to be finished faster within those, these two months. Yeah. You know, two months are very less. <coughs> they are less, but yeah. that is, we are hoping so that it is going to pass. Yeah. You know, everything, when you put everything in God. It's going to be possible. Nothing is impossible in God. Yeah. So yeah. according to the, your statement, it seems that you are you are struggling so that you can make sure the, the project is within two months. Yeah. It is over. Yeah. Yeah. So I wish you that uh, within these two months, yeah. make sure that the project. Yeah. Within these two months, Mama Anne's kitchen will be ready and she will be enjoying there on her modern kitchen. And guys, you can see the clothes are here. Yeah, you know, you know, here by day my mom doesn't have that, that, what do we call? Yeah. Cloth line. Yeah, that cloth line. So they usually hang the clothes here in the, in the fence. So, yeah, and also they usually hang the, them there at the kitchen there. Yeah, but what I'm hoping that, yeah, and my prayer is that to get that makeup, yeah, that metal so that I can put it here. Yeah. When I will get that metal, I will put it here. Yeah, so that my mom can be, so that it can be easy for, I mean that I, I need a metal here so that I can place the cloth line here so that my mom can, it can be easy for her. To put the to hang the clothes, you know, it's very it's it, by the way, it's it doesn't look good for her to to hang the clothes on the fence. By the way, I see that, but I'm hoping that I will get that metal and the 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 lock those locks so that I can I can put them here. I can she can it can be easy for her to hang the clothes. Yeah, and. 
and also guys you know the our dream by the way you know our dream is our dream is in two months guys in two months mama Anne's kitchen will be ready and also mama Anne's garden kitchen will be ready in two months she will be harvesting the the the, the vegetables there you know i planted also carrots spinach kumawikis all types of vegetables there so in two months days mama Anne's kitchen will be ready she will be cooking there on her her very modern and her very good smart kitchen and also harvesting the vegetables and that is our prayer and that is our our ambition remember guys it is on a sad moment to the family yeah by the day it's a sad moment to the family as we told you as my, my mom also told you that my dad is going to give us to tell us yeah how that sad moment is yeah guys and remember my dad is back yeah right now he's uh, he's back here yeah because of that sad moment by day yeah he's the one who is going to tell us why it is the sad moment to the family <coughs> we're heading inside to go and see my dad and we are going to have a conversation inside there with my dad and he's going to tell us why is the sad moment at home why is the sad moment so let's go inside and guys keep on watching the video i hope you will know more you will know why is the sad moment at, at the family and i'm hoping that you really enjoy the video remember to subscribe on our our channel if you haven't like the video share and comments yeah guys so right now we are heading we are heading inside to go and check on my dad and to have a conversation with him so let's go okay guys by the way keep in watching this video till the end and i'm hoping that you are really enjoying the video yeah sad moment at mama Anne's family so consider subscribing on our youtube channel if you haven't and also like the video share and comment also on how to on how you think about this video yeah so today as you see i'm here with my dad yeah we are going to have a conversation together yeah with my dad here so that before we proceed you can just introduce yourself before we go on okay I'm greeting all now salimia what uh, all the guys uh, in that video uh, today I'll go to my grandfather uh, for that uh, matanga okay my people matanga means funeral yeah my dad was just saying that Today he was at the funeral and he has just came back from there, from the funeral. And that's why we told you that we have a, a sad moment at our family. So let our dad tell us what is going on. And as you know very well, I told you that right now we have three, funer three funerals. Yeah. We have three funerals, but one has just passed because my dad went there on Saturday and they burial. Yeah, they have just burial one that of her, of his manager, by the way. Yeah, his manager's in law. Yeah, whom I told you that also his manager in law passed that passed away. So they went there on Saturday and they bar burial him. And now we yeah, have just remained. And now we have just remained with two funerals. Yeah, that of my aunt, my aunt husband, and my grandfather. So we can just hear from him um, how the funeral will go on and what is what step that they have just um, put on. Yeah. So my people, by the to our family by the day, it's a sad moment because losing two people at the same time by the day, it's not easy. Yeah, we as Mama Anne's family, 
we have to attend there to all the two funerals, you know. We have to go to my aunt and also to my grandma, to my grandfather. And that is a bit difficult, but we we have planned on how we will go there. Yeah, and I myself, I'll go there and also my family there where I'm married. We have just planned on which day we, we will go to check on them. Yeah, so I think you just keep us on players, you know, everything everything is possible in player and as we put God first, in fact everything is possible in God. Yeah, so yeah, so by the it's a sad moment to the family, my people, as you can see also my dad is really sad on lo losing her, his his father by the way, yeah. by losing his father and also his in-law yeah his brother-in-law he's so sad dad i'm saying sorry for you so guys that's why my dad is tired yeah yesterday night they went to the funeral and he slept there yeah at her his dad by the way, yeah, he slept there and you can see he's very busy and tired but that that don't worry yeah don't worry about that so what is the plan there uh, saving hmm? um paleto ni mchango ndio hmm. uh, tutakuja tu tufanye kesho hmm. Uh, alafu jumatano yeah. alihamisi mm. tuweke babu okay he is just saying that the the preparation day is about tomorrow will be co for contribution yeah tomorrow and on wednesday the body will be they will go and bring the body and on thursday they will bury, 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 they will bury him, yeah, so that's the preparation of that, of that funeral for our grandfather, and how about of that of our aunt? Auntie, Jimatano, mm -hmm. Nchango, eh, Adiamisi, Ade, Okay, he's just saying that uh, that of my aunt, the contribution will be on Wednesday, on Thursday, the body to arrive at his home and on Friday to be buried. buried. Okay. So, that is how it is, guys, as you, has, you have heard on, on, on our father. Yeah, that is how, that is what we were truly telling you that it's a sad moment at the family by the way, you know, losing two people at the same time by the day, it's not easy. So right now we are mourning, guys, we are mourning on our grandfather and our, 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 our in-law, but let us put us in prayers in this hard time that we are going on and everything will be well. So thank you so much, Charlie. Yeah, so guys, in fact, keep us on prayers as I told you that this time we, we are, by the way, we are in a sad moment to this family and we are working hard to, yeah, we are working hard to go to those two funerals at, at the same time. And we are working hard as uh, our family also to, you know, here in Africa, in fact, when persons, when one person died, you have to contribute something also to the family. And we, as this family, we have to contribute. And yeah, so we are hoping everything will be well. And as you can see, my mom is not around here. Yeah, she's, she's preparing something outside there. And she will, by the way, she's, preparing something outside there and 
very soon I is to I'm going to join her. Yeah, I'm going to join her. So guys, keep supporting us. Yeah, in fact, keep supporting us in this hard time, in these hard situations. Yeah, we need your support, we need your advice also. And we will appreciate for that. In fact, we will appreciate. Yeah, and if you haven't subscribed to this part, to this channel, yeah, subscribe, like the video, share and comment, yeah, on how you think about today's video. And also, if you subscribe, remember to turn on the notification bell, yeah, so that you can just get all the notification, all the video that I we upload, yeah, so that you can get them. Yeah. So, right now, guys, we are heading to the funeral. Yeah, after finishing here, yeah, heading to the funeral, we all as a family, yeah, we are going there to check on how things are going there, you know, Wednesday is the, tomorrow for the, for the grandfather's burial, to, tomorrow is the contribution day, so we have to go there and do some things there, you know, tomorrow many visitors will be arriving there, yeah, so we have to go there and do something there, and also on Wednesday, yeah, so that is how things are going here, guys. But we are hoping everything will be well. Yeah. So thank you so much. Thank you so much for being with us. Thank you so much for watching our video. Thank you so much for taking your time watching our video. You know, it is not easy for us to reach it is because of you guys. If you you are not the one, maybe we couldn't have reached at this far. So we really appreciate you so much. We really appreciate your concern. We really appreciate your support, your advice that you give to this family. In fact, we really appreciate for that all. So thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. We love you all. So let us see. Let us meet in the next video. Thank you. Bye-bye.